with striped bass, uh, our stocking is part of a striped bass restoration effort on the Cape Fear River. The population is not at a self-sustaining level, so we're actually introducing hatchery fish to help accomplish a self-sustaining population. Well, right now we're taking down one of our striped bass ponds. So for the last few months we've been feeding these uh, regularly three times a day and so now it's obviously harvest time. So we have a lot of controls in this kettle box here that basically can control the level of the water at this point. And so we want it to go down slow but not, not too slow. And so essentially we want it to go slow enough to where they are drawn into this box that you're gonna see here in just a minute so that they're easily harvested. Of course our trucks are loaded by weight. Uh, they depart our hatchery, it takes about 30 to 45 minutes to travel to the stocking location. Once the truck arrives at the stocking location, they typically will back down a ramp, get it close to the water's edge, fire up a water pump to acclimate the fish over to the water that they're fixing to go into. Our stocking locations on the Cape Fear are relatively close to us. It's only about a 30 to 30 minutes to an hour drive. But we do take time to acclimate the fish over to the water that they're going into, and that can take anywhere from an hour, an hour and a half. So total about three to four hours per stocking trip. 